Now to the excitement surrounding Super Bowl 51. Today, the Super Bowl host committee will unveil the official countdown clock. Yeah, you know, we got our own countdown of course. clock. Not quite as cool, but there it is. 360 <laughs> days and change away from Super Bowl 51. Courtney Gilmore live at NRG Stadium this morning. Courtney, they got uh, that new clock. It's just one of four, I understand. Yeah, Owen, just one of four. You know, I got so excited about it, I lost my voice a little bit. But there's going to be one at Bush, one at Hobby, Discovery Green, and this one behind me will be unveiled in just a few hours. Let the countdown begin. Mayor Sylvester Turner and the Houston Super Bowl host committee were officially handed the Super Bowl reigns in San Francisco. And now the sky's the limit, literally. Super Bowl 51 is officially on the clock. Houston, we have kickoff. The hope is to produce an out of this world experience come February 5th, 2017. We'll not only take them to space, but we'll take them throughout the globe. And then we'll give them a, the southern hospitality that no one else can give, like the city of Houston. More than 1.1 million visitors will head to Houston for the largest single sporting event in the U.S., which can have a huge economic impact. I think for the city of Houston, we're looking at more than 500 million just for the Super Bowl alone. And if the Pro Bowl should come, it will be quite a bit more. 10,000 volunteers will be needed to help pull off the big event. As the countdown continues, Mayor Turner says the city has to be prepared not only for safety measures, but transportation as well. Well, this will be the third time that the Super Bowl will be hosted here in Houston. For now, reporting live at NRG, I'm Courtney Gilmore, KPRC, Channel 2 News.